hello everyone so to, in today's class we are going to see how you can check stock report so in today's class we are going to see how you can check a stock report for a single material so for that you need to go to a t code that is called mmbe so you need to go to mmbe transaction so here just enter it now you can see there are multiple selections are there so here you have to put the material number let's say any kind of material number you can take from here let's say 1287 we are taking this one so you can put the selection as plan storage location batch whatever things you need you can enter but this is not mandatory only you have to put the material number over here okay then here are there are multiple selections are there also select some multi, uh, special stock if there is any special kind of stock is there so it will be showing you for that one only any commitments are there stock commitments are there it will be showing you the commitments also here if there is any special stock indicator is there you can select it on that so here display label you can select like uh, from the company code label plant label storage location label batch label and special stock label you can select any one of it let's say everything is selected then it will show all of the stocks for every label it will be showing you so let's now just execute it so if you are selecting the plant or you are entering the plant it will show you on the plant label only so you can see this is the different kind of company codes are there so first one is thousand is a company code t100 is a company code inside that there are some plants are there okay so if you are going to have all the details like uh, let's say for this material is available in which company codes all of the details you need you don't enter any selection for any plants you don't select it then it will show you all total data for this plant uh, for this material if you are selecting let's say we are just entering t110 plant okay we are just entering t110 plant so it will show you us whatever material is available for t110 plant okay without let's say for every storage location it will show you the stock let's say you are only looking for only for one storage location then you can enter the storage location also okay so let's just execute this one so here you can see this is the because we have checked all the check boxes for company code plant storage location everything we have checked so that's why in the left hand side it is showing for all of the information let's say this is the company code details this is the plan details this is the storage location t001 and wms1 and there is also a special stock is there vendor consignment stock is a special stock is there so that's why it is showing under vendor consignment stock because we have some stock inside our consignment label also okay so this is the information on the organization level where you are having the uh, material or where you are having the stock and in the right side right hand side you can see there are different structure or different sections are there so first one is unrestricted stock so this is actually you can use directly from this stock directly this is the unrestricted stock next one is quality inspection so this stock you cannot use so this stock first you need to do the quality inspection for that once your quality inspection has been done then you have to move this to the unrestricted stock then you can use it so next one is if anything reserve stock is there then it will be showing under here if there is any on order stock means this is the for this number of items or this number of quantity PO is available okay so there are POs are available for this stock so once you are putting a PO or you are creating a PO it will show the quantity under the on order stock because you are putting the order so once you are doing the GR it will come to either unrestricted stock or where you are doing the GR on that label it will be showing you okay so next one is consignment order if anything like you can see the unrestricted stock is in vendor consignment if you are giving some consignment order then it will be showing you under the consignment order stock next one is stock transfer so here if you have anything under stock transfer then it will be showing for you next one is gr block stock so if you are doing any kind of stock that is gr block stock so that will be showing you over here 
so these are some different kinds of stocks are there block stock return stock schedule for delivery agr block stock transfer stock transfer consignment order so these are different different kinds of stocks are there available so if you are having any kind of stocks like that it will be showing you under the relevant category okay so this is all about your stock report this is a basic stock report from which you can get a stock report for a single material okay so i believe so i believe you are able to understand these prospective of mmb so basically the t code you need to notice or you need to note down that it is the mmb t code so in the inside the mmb whenever you need to have some stock report like where the stock is available all that things you can check in mmb so that's it for today let's meet up again on tomorrow till then bye bye and take care